Hello all. Welcome to Career Launcher. As a part of our daily practice questions that have appeared in our mocks that we are releasing on YouTube, in this particular video, you'll be able to see GP Sir solving a question based on data interpretation. Okay, let's have a look at this particular set now. Corporation Office has come with a new grade scheme for potential property buyers that's based on four broad parameters. Okay, these are the parameters. Every property that is on sale is given credit points for each parameter and then the weighted average is used. So weighted as a data set to calculate the selling price of the builder. Credit points are allotted on a scale of 0 to 25 so that 25 is the best possible score. Buyer has to pay a property registration amount along with the builder price. And then we have the graph which shows the credit points for each of the five properties mentioned out here. Okay. Now, next thing, we need to fill up a table possibly. We need to create a table so that we can do this. Obviously, then you'll also have things like uh, um, selling price out here. Okay. So once you have the weighted average points, okay, weighted average points, you should also be able to get the selling price and other things. Uh, so let's quickly go through this information and, and then decide how to go about doing this particular set. It is known that weighted uh, weightage of location, amenity, security and living area is 0 0.41, 0 0.1, 0 0.3 and 0 0.2. So it is 40%, 10%, 30% and 20%. Weightage, the weighted average of credit points multiplied with 2.5 obtain the selling price. So whatever is the weighted average we get multiply with 2.5, we get the selling price. Okay, so this is fine. Extra cost for parking space is 5 lakhs. So 5 lakhs if you want the parking space. Registration, registration amounts of property is a multiple of sum of credit points from location and living area. So location plus living area multiplied with something gives us the registration amount. For property R, it is 4.4 lakhs. What is it for property R? Location plus living area, 44 points. So 44 points into the multiple 44 into x is 4.4 lakhs or 440,000. So x is equal to 10,000. So what this tells me is to find the registration amount points for location plus living area multiplied with 10,000 to, to, to get the uh, registration amount. Total cost for the, for the buyer is equal to sum of selling price, parking space if required and the registration cost. Great. Now the obvious next thing is should, should I make the table or no? I will say no. Such data sets typically have independent questions. Please look here. These are independent questions. And you should fill up the table as you go along rather than filling it first and then going. Because very rarely does it happen that you need all the information in the table or for all properties in this particular case to, to get to the answer. Okay. So let's start solving this data set. We'll keep filling up the table as we go along. I will typically not fill the table first because as I said, the questions are independent in nature. This has a weightage of 40%, 10%, 30%, and 20%. This is given. If you want to go to the question very quickly, please do so. If early bird discount of 10%, again, Mrs. Shukla, her, she has some specific requirement. Mr. Raj works on his requirement. Okay, so, so as you keep doing the question, keep filling up the table. Hopefully, you will not need the entire table or even if you need it, you will have filled up as you go along, okay? which obviously will save some time for you. Okay, question one. If there's an early but discount of 10% on all the above mentioned property, then how many of them have a selling price of less than 50 lakhs? To get to the selling price, you multiply the weighted average with 2.5 lakhs. If I want the selling price below 50 lakhs, what does that mean? It means the weighted average of the points should be less than 20. 20 into 2.5 is 50, right? But this is after the discount of 10%. Okay, This is the discount after 10% discount. The weighted average of points should be 20, less than 20. So that means the weighted average of the points should be 20 upon 0 0.9, which is equal to 200 upon 9 or 22.22. So for this question, my key thing is, if the weighted average of points is less than 22.22 then the selling price will be less than 50 lakhs otherwise it is going to be a selling price of more than 50 lakhs okay now let's look at do we need to complete do we need do we need the price of all five let us see look at these should you not just start from the biggest one the most expensive is going to be q look at the sum of points so check for q 
What is it for Q? 23%, 40% of 23 is 70. 23 into 4, 92. 92, 9.2 plus 2.5. 9.2 plus 2.5. What is it for security and living? 24 percent, 24 into 372, so 7.2 and 4.8. 7.2 and 4.8. Summation 7, 4, 11, 12, 12 and 9, 21, 23.7. What was the number we had? 22.1. So Q will not be below 20, 50 lakhs. So incorrect. Which one should be the next one? Okay, you have T and R which are almost similar. 20, 20, 21, 19, 24, 22. We'll probably need to check both of them. Let's look at R first. 8 plus 1.9. 8 plus 1.9. 8 then 6.6 and 4.8. What does it become? 8 and 1, 9, 9 and 6, 15, 15 and 4, 19, 19.9 .9 and 0.8, 20.7. So this is definitely below 50 lakh. I just need to check for T also. It should also be below 50 lakh because they are almost the same. Okay. So there might be a minor variation, but just for the sake of completion, I am doing this. For 20, 40% of 28 plus 2.1. 24 is 7.2. And 3.8, 7.2 and 3.8. 7, 3, 10 and 1, 11, 12, 13, 13 and 8, uh, 21. So 21.1. I hope this is right. 8 and 2, 10, 10, 7, 17, 20, 20.8, 20, 21. Point. Oh, hold, hold on, hold. 7, 3, 10 and 1, 11, 11, 13, 11 and 8, 19, 21. Yeah, 21. Point one. So no issues at all. So both these will be less. And th does that also not mean that S and P would also be less than 50 lakhs? I'll say four properties. Except for Q, all the other properties will be less than 50 lakhs. Mrs. Shukla lives alone, so security is her first, is her first priority. While she's ready to compromise on other parameters, what is the minimum selling price for the apartment that fits her requirement? If I want the minimum selling price, I'm going to not include the parking into it. Okay. So security, which flat has the best security rating T and Q. We have done it for both of them. Which is cheaper? T. So we'll go with T. Yeah. So we go with T. T is 21.1. So it is 21.1 into 2.5. How much is 21.1 into 2.5? 20 into 2.5 is 50. 1 into 2.5 is 2.5. 0.1 into 2.5 is 0.25. So while many people think calculation is difficult, calculation can be very easy. 52.75. If you break the, if you learn to break the number into smaller components. Okay. Third question. Mr. Large works from home. So location and security are not his priorities, but he wants a close parking space. So 5 lakhs added. If he can avail a bank loan for 85% of the total cost, what was the total cost? Selling price, parking space, registration amount. Yeah. Then what is the minimum amount that he has to pay from his pocket to for an apartment in the city? He has to pay 15% of the total cost. So let's call calculate the total cost. And he does not have a preference for any location or security. Parking space is required. About the other parameters, there's no preference given. So we'll go for the cheapest out of the five flats. Okay. Which one will be the cheapest? If not sure, do the calculation for both of them, both the remaining flags. Okay. So so just do this 40, 10, 30, and 20%. Okay. We have already done it for, for T, R, and Q. Which is going to be cheaper? This one, S or P? I will go with this. Why? Because the 40% weight item is lower out here. Okay. The 10% weight item is almost the same. And similarly, the others, the gap is negligible. So it is this which is determining for me the cheapest item. But if you are not sure, you might as well do the calculation of both of them. Okay, so let's do it for S first. 6.4, 40 40% of 16, 2, 6, 6.4, 6. I'm sorry. And what is it for the last one? 
Want to check for the remaining one also? Let's do that. If you are not sure, it is safer to do it. So 8.4, 2, 8.4 and 2. Five point four and four. Okay. So eight and two, ten, ten, five, fifteen, ten, five, uh, fifteen and four, nineteen, nineteen point four, nineteen point eight. Which is what I meant by saying I would not have done it in the exam, but but just did it here to 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 make sure that all of you who are not sure will have a clarity on this issue also. Okay. So so he wants he will go for the cheapest, which is eighteen point six. Now, what is 18.6 into 2.5? Again, 18.6 into 2 will be 18 to the 36. 36, that means 37.2. And 18.6 into 5 is 18.6 by 2, 9.3. So, this is the property price. Then, what do we have? We have 5 lakhs of, so, okay, so what is this going to be? 46.5. 5 lakhs of registration. And you also uh, five lakhs of parking space. Sorry, and then we also have to look at the registration. Registration for sixteen plus twenty one thirty seven. Thirty seven means three point seven lakhs. Point two six and six twelve and three fifteen so fifty five point two. How much will he need to pay? He needs to pay fifteen percent of fifty five point two from his pocket. What is 10% of 55.2? 10% is 5.52. 5% will be half of 5.52, which is 2.76. 7, 5, 12, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8.28 8 lakhs. Right? So, three questions solved. And with the entire table filled up now, I'll just erase all the irrelevant stuff from the sheet and then we go to the fourth question. So, this was 52.75, this was 4, this was 8.28 8 lakhs. Government changed and they introduced new laws. Consequently, weightages were interchanged so that the, in such a manner that no parameter had the same weightage as before. It was also known that two parameters had swapped. If two parameters had swapped the weightage, then the remaining two will also swap. S gained the maximum appreciation in selling price because of new laws. Okay. What is the change in the total cost? If S has gained the most, that means the item for which S had earlier 10% now should become 40%. Item for which S had 10%, which is this, now has to become 40%. So that is where the maximum change will happen. So 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 we can say these two will interchange and these two will interchange. Okay. I will just clean up. Yeah. So this was originally 40%, 10%, 30%, and 20%. What will it become now? I am just changing the color of the pen. This will now become 40% here. Why? Because for S to gain the most, the 10% item weight should become the maximum. Okay. This will be 10. And the remaining 2 will also interchange. So this will be 20%. This will be 30%. So what is the change for the, in the price value of S? Okay. We want to find the change in the total cost of S. The total cost will be only account of the selling price. The registration and parking will still remain the same. Right? Because these 16 and 21 are not changing. So, registration cannot change. Okay. So, 16 points from 40% becomes 10%. So, it has a negative minus 30%. For these 20 points, there will be a positive 30%. Right? For these 24 points, it is going to be Instead of 30% weight, it will become 20% weight. So, there is a decline of 10%. And, sorry, for these 20 points, not 24, this is 20. I am, I am mixed up. Okay. The last one, for these 21 points, it is a weight of, from 20% it has gone to 10, 30%, so plus 10%. Now, what is this? 16, 30%. Minus 30 is 4.8 plus 6. Right? 30% 30 30 of 26. And what about this? 
sorry, this will again be minus minus 10% of 2 is 2 and plus 10% of 21 is 2.1. So what is the change? 1.2, 1.3. So change is 1.3. Okay, so 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 we got 1.3. So 1.3 and and the change in cost will be into 2.5. Which is 1.3 into 2.5 is going to be 3.25 lakhs. Okay. So question which comes, which can come is, should we also worry about the the registration amount? The answer is no. The registration amount is a multiple of sum of credit points, not the weighted average. The credit points are not changing. It is the weights which have changed. So the answer will be 3.25 lakhs for this particular question.